Hello? Hello? How's it going? How's, How's it going, going? man? <laughs> I hope you weren't watching that. You, you ignored me. Um, no, I didn't see it. Yeah, it's all, it's all good, of course. Um, so, so first things first, like, how much do you, like, how much do you know about chess? That's the first thing that I always, like, start with, because, like, it really determines, like, what I'm going to show you. Uh, so I'll be completely honest. Uh, I have no strategy. I know how the pieces move. I know what the pieces are called, uh, mostly. Mm -hmm. Um, do you know, I guess, you, do you know what the value, like the, the actual values of the pieces are or not? Yeah, like, in a sense, I do. Like the pawns are like your weakest ones that, you know, you can kind of sacrifice, I guess. Um, mm -hmm. I, I don't have it tiered out completely, but I know your rooks and your horses and your uh, bishops are important, but your queen is probably the most important. Right. So, so basically, the to start with the basics, a queen is worth nine. Okay. Okay. Like nine points. And a, yeah, it's worth nine points. The the rooks or the towers, they're worth five points. Okay. And then like the knights and the bishops are worth about uh, three points. So that's how you want to gauge like your risk, I guess. Exactly. So I'm gonna send you a link. Let me see. Can you uh, can you open that link or not? It should. Um, yep. Or wait, maybe it does. Okay. But, uh, so do you see the position? Oh, let me double check. I'm not in your game. I'm just on a chessboard. Okay, one second. Let me see. Um, is it easier if we just get into a game versus each other? Or no, we can't really um, go sure. back. Yeah, we, yeah well, let's, let's just do it that way. So do you know the first... Actually, do you know the basic thing that you're trying to accomplish at the start of the game? Like what the starting, the meta or the, no. the strategy is at the beginning? No. So, so generally what you want to do... Do you know what castling is? Uh, That's when you swap your king and your... Uh, your your uh rook right like they swap yeah, positions exactly yep so normally you try to move the pieces in between the king and the rook and bring them uh put them on some squares generally in the center uh and try to get the king out of the center of the board oh uh, so you want to castle as soon as possible so your king is safe and you can't get yes. trapped mm -hmm. now most of the time you try to castle to the uh so for you this would be to your your right normally you call it like the king side castle so you try you try to get the pieces oh, the, to the, I to see. the right yeah Move those pieces forward. Get the king next to the right. To the rook. Get the and... king next to the rook. Yeah, do that. Do that little trick. Okay. Um. Okay. Good move. I'm just gonna develop. Is it bad if I move? Oh, you move forward one. So it's not that bad to just move forward one. That's a good move. Very, very good. Okay. Now this is this is not not a bad move, but normally there there is this structure. You see how you have these three pawns, uh, the one uh, right up one square from your king on the dark square, and then the pawn. You know, those three pawns are kind of almost it's almost like a triangle. Right. Uh, these three oh pawns. yeah, I see what you're saying at the bottom right. For me, it's a right. Triangle. So normally this, this is what we call like a, a fianchetto, and so mm -hmm. when you put the pawns like this, normally you want to put that bishop on the light square that's one square up, as opposed to bringing it to to square it's on. Because if you look at this uh, where this bishop is right now, think of it as like. As like a sniper basically it's just aiming at this pawn but you're never going to be able to capture this pawn so it's kind of but if i go into that second square i'm just blocked off by my horse in the short term yes now again this is this is much more advanced but but basically the point that i'm making is that normally when you do set up this uh these three pawns like this you want to put the bishop there but it's okay. fine so what's your what's your next move just following the theme um i would say i'm still trying to so i, I now i would go here right i do the castle mm -hmm. very very good so this is the the first step of what you want to accomplish now there are many different opening strategies you can use to do this but this is this is the first step of of like trying to understand and get better at the game of chess because if you keep the king in the middle of the board it's much more vulnerable mm -hmm. than once it's castled this is a defensive style of play i guess maybe uh, pretty much everybody does it at the very start of the game oh, okay so both teams are actively trying to do it yeah, because if you look at what I've done, also you look at my moves, I've also gotten my king out of the center of the board, too. Right. So what happens is, is when you're newer to the game, you want uh, sort of open files, open lines. So it's easier to, to understand, whereas when the position is very closed here, do you know what a file is? No. So, okay, if you look at, um, you see where your, your king is and my king, the kings that are uh, opposite yeah. each other? Yep. This is basically called the G file, because you, you see the G, oh, and yeah. this is called the G the file. G, so it's like from the, lane. the first one to the eighth. Yeah, so it's like the lane exactly up and down from one into the other so we call these like we call these files so like generally you want them to be, you want those these open lanes or these open files in chess and in our current position there are none that are open so it's very so it's very hard to play for um to, to have like a straightforward plan here right so right now we, the game has to unfold a bit before you can actually set something up because there's no open lanes exactly mm -hmm. yeah uh I didn't mean to do that. That's fine. Oh, that's, okay. that's fine. 
No, no, it's 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 completely fine. I, I don't really expect you to have like a clear plan. You haven't made any blunders yet, so this is this is quite good. Okay. Yeah, I'm trying to be very careful. Uh, the thing is, I wouldn't have this much time in a normal game, but if I if I'm able to take my time, I feel like I can kind of think through better. But um, then the fucking the game will take like two hours though if I if I do that. So I need to be mindful of that as well. I would say the main thing is you don't you don't want to make mis you, you try not to uh, give up your your pieces. For free. nothing in return. That's that's the most important thing at the very start. Right. Yeah, I'm just gonna keep it simple, I think. For now. Okay, very good. Okay, I'm gonna develop. And then I'll uh counter develop. Okay, very good. <laughs> okay. Yeah, so far you're playing you're playing completely fine. This is good so far. Um so there's gonna be trades here. I'm definitely picking up on that. Uh the question is so I, when i think about trades and i i have to think about if i'm going to come out on top i think that's the most important thing but since let's see if i kill him then you're going to kill me with no i think you win this trade so i'm not going to actually enter this because are you sure i think you win because after i kill your pawn then your uh horse you're yes. not your horse will kill my pawn and then i can mm -hmm. kill him with my horse but then your other horse can kill me Right now, that's actually even because that's uh, both sides get one pawn and they get one knight. Oh, so it would just be a fair trade. But yeah, I no, feel like the bad thing it, about it yeah. is that you would get a lot of map control, maybe, right? Because you would yeah. end up yeah. in the center of the screen with your horse. So mm -hmm. maybe I ignore that and I move on to something else. Yeah, that's that's pretty good understanding of what's what's happening. Yeah, basically what we what, what we would call is you would say there's more space. Like where the pieces are, I have more space in the center part of, of the map. Okay. Uh, now we got an issue. We got an issue on our hand. I can't afford to lose this piece like that. So I'm going to have mm -hmm. to get out of the situation. But it appears I have to go back, actually, because everything else I do is a kill for you. Right. So I'm out of mm -hmm. here. Okay. And then now that's a piece for you. But that's okay if you want to do that. I'll give you that move. So I'm going to do this which i think won't get me killed if i look very closely is it worth it yeah why not okay so i see you setting up a trap I, i'm feeling i'm feeling uh i'm feeling something getting set up right now uh, I need, to, I need well, to. yeah yeah because also i i mean basically i just gave you a free pawn you just got this pawn for nothing so so of course there has to be some reason because I wouldn't just give you that pawn for for no reason. Right. Normally. Also, I see there's some sort of crossover going over there. So how can I? I can't. What is a re? Can I recastle or swap positions of my king and? Uh... No. Once once you've already done that, you can't. You can't. Do you can it. only castle once no. a game. Correct. Yes. Gotcha. Wait, you're gonna get a free piece here. I need to adjust for that as well. This is a dangerous move out of me, but I'm doing it. I think it makes sense. Okay. The, so you played the best move. Okay, that's good to hear. But I play. It sounds like I played the best move, but I'm still fucked. That's what it sounds like you just said to me. P pretty much, yeah. <laughs> pretty much. Is there a way out of the situation for me? That's all I want to know. I don't know what's about to happen, um, but you, you mean like if I was, you mean like if I was playing like a professional player here? Uh, yes. Like, is there moves for me to get out of this? About a Probably whatsoever? not. No, it's done. <laughs> if you if you're playing if you're playing bad. another grandmaster, even they can't get out of the situation that I'm in right now, which I don't know what it is. They would probably yeah they they would probably lose. Yeah, they'd probably resign. Not resign here, but they would lose this like 95% of the time, if not more. Oh, f I, the thing is, I don't even know what's about to happen. And then, yeah, you're telling me that. It sucks. I see that. I don't know. I've lost the motivation after you said that. <laughs> well, okay, but try try to. But but this is actually very useful because you're gonna. There's a certain theme here that's really important as well. I feel like I'm like I'm, I feel like I'm like uh, tunneled up, and one of my pieces can't go really anywhere. But okay, let's yeah, do and so th this. Th this. Mm -hmm. Go ahead. Okay. Okay. Oh fuck! I honestly didn't even see that guy. So you think I'm gonna kill him there? But I'm not gonna do it. What this? As an escape strategy. Okay. Wait, no! I'm gonna check. Oh, okay. And <laughs> me. <laughs> so, okay. Let me let me let me get this. Uh, I, th I think actually, how I do I just copy this? One second. Um, <laughs> let me uh, get the fence so that I can. Uh, one second. 
it's probably better if you do like uh puzzles i'm guessing so i maybe maybe i should just like if, if you do those puzzles um maybe you do the puzzles without the timer so if, if you go to puzzles and you do um i, I forget if it's called uh, unlimited I, i'll just like i can just watch your stream we can go through the puzzles directly okay should i just leave this game then yeah you should just go back to the puzzles okay. yeah what's up dudes i just want to give a quick reminder if you haven't hit that subscribe button smash that shit right now i appreciate all the support you guys are the best so this is, uh, I think I was doing this very briefly before, but this is just you trying to make one move to checkmate, right? So generally, it's, this, it's the same thing. It's either like you're a checkmating pattern or um, or you're going to win a big trade. Like you'll win like a queen, which is worth nine for like a bishop, which is worth three. Okay, so this one's something, super something easy. Yeah. This is just, you just go forward. Oh. So well, do you know what, uh, do you know what an ice skater is? An ice skater? Uh, if it's a move in chess, no. I'm sorry. So I was I was using an ecstasy term. This is what we call a back rank checkmate. You see how the pawns are all all in the way. Yeah. So so basically, when you capture the rook here, the king has no squares. The king can't go up, which would just be checkmate. Yeah. So this is just easy, just simple. Wait, so mm -hmm. what's the what's the skating rank reference in terms of this? Oh, oh I don't know. That was just some XQC. Oh yeah. Okay. So I, I don't know. You said the three pawns. The king looks like an ice skater. I, I have no idea. Okay. Anyway. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Okay. So so yeah. So it's checkmate. Okay. So now we look at this position. First things first is I think again you you want to look are there any captures? Uh, ca when you say shots? captures, you mean like kills, right? Kill, yeah, I mean kills, yeah, okay. exactly. Um, there there is a capture, but if I do it, then I, I don't get it. I just lose my king. Yeah, yeah. so I want to maybe I want to move into a piece where I think I want to go uh, here. So again, the, yeah. Uh, wait, wait, wait. Where where do you want to go? Uh, actually, no. I I just want to. This is the easy check. Wait, no, I have to move my king. Sorry, I, I'm, I'm actually, no. He's, right? No, no, I, actually, no, no, you're not in check. The pawn's going the other way, actually. So, yeah. Is he going this way? The pawn's going down the board, not up the board. So, no, your king's, he's okay. not going to capture your king. So, you, you're, yeah, yeah, the pawn's going the other way. You see how it says five below? Oh. The pawn's going down. So, now I'm uh, white to move, and I'm trying to checkmate black. Uh, I think I, oh, what, I didn't even mean to move. What? I didn't, uh, okay. Oh, I didn't even mean to click there uh black to move um yeah. this would be so this one seems like there's more to it uh, okay so now again now okay so what i would say is until you're sure of the move don't don't click on the pieces, okay actually really important um okay so are there are there any kills here um we have a kill uh wait do we have a kill no we have kills on our queen we have kills on our pawn as well on the mm -hmm. left Right. So, so again, you're looking for kills. You're looking for checks. Oh, I have a queen kill here as well, actually. Which, which saw one do you think one. it is? I, I just saw this one, but the queen kill on the pawn C2 to uh, G3. Yeah, very nice. And then that would give me a check, and then he'd be forced to the right or the left. Mm -hmm. uh, so should I make that move? Yes. Okay. And then he'd be forced here. And then in which place... I would go here and it's checkmate, I think. Then he can't. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. oh actually, no, 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 no. Sorry. No, there's a rook there. Oh, no. I, I think I killed this pawn. Sorry. That's the move. I killed this pawn to my left. No, you don't. No, you don't. Just just look a little bit. Again, you, when when in this position, actually, one thing that's really important to look at is count how many uh, how much material you have and your opponent has. In oh, this yeah. position, you have a lot less, actually. If you're down like a rook or you're down a queen, you're way behind. So if the game continues for much longer, you're, you're going to lose the game. Because you're way behind. You're, right. you're, you're down a lot. Needs to end fast um, you're on down a lot side. Trees. Yeah. So like you want to look to see what what are the uh what are the checks that you have here? Um one check I have is just moving my queen to the left, but then he can easily just kill my or no, he would have to move his king. Yeah, he would have to move his right. king. Yeah, I think that's one check for sure, because he has to move his okay. king. Mm -hmm. Oh wait, I see what it is. Oh, it's so simple. It's I just move my queen to F two. Uh, yeah, and that is checkmate because you can't go left or right. Right. I see. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, it's it's fine. It's it's not it's not easy. But the thing is, like again, looking at all the possible checks that exist. Yeah, a checking is hard. Now, now, I'm not now, experienced with hard. checking. This one is hard. I think actually looking for checks is probably the most important thing. Where where you're at is look looking for checks. Always looking for checks, and also yeah. looking out for my king's checks too, probably. Right. So I'm gonna give you a hint. This is another back rank checkmate. So back ba rank. by back rank, we mean the, the last rank of the board. So we, we have what are the lanes which are up and down. 
And then you have the um, you have the ranks, which are like the the first rank where the king is right now, the second rank where the pawns are, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So you have the eight ranks. Right. You're just talking about the rows on the board, right? As ranks. Right. Exactly. Yeah. I think my queen has to kill uh, his rook, and that's it. Mm -hmm. I, is that is that maybe that's even it? I don't think you can do uh, anything after that. Go ahead and play the move. Go ahead and play it. Yeah. Do it. Okay. Yeah. Wait. No. 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 Hold on. Hold on. I take it back because he has a knight there. I don't know. Right. He can just kill me. His knight can go backwards. Can it go backwards? It can. It can go backwards. Yes. But if he does that, yeah, just. For oh, it's still checkmate. I see what you're saying. My rook just go forward. My rook just goes forward, and I win. Yeah, it's it's exact same uh same pattern as before. It just requires a sacrifice uh in order to achieve it. Right, and then I just kill his you queen give here. Queen. Yep. And then I win. Easy. Very good. Easy. So now this one you're behind. Now, do you remember that theme? There's this is actually the same theme that you've seen a few times already. So I'm curious how quickly you'll get this one. Um, white to you're, move. you're down by two rooks here. You're down by two rooks, but there's a common theme that you've seen in several other of these uh, puzzles. Okay. Um. Oh, I, it is simple. It's done. I just kill his rook and he's done. Yeah. Exactly. Oh. But then that doesn't change anything because I can just kill this guy too. I, I feel like this move that they're adding into this uh, equation, I guess they're trying to just make you look at it again. I guess they're basically uh, it's, they're basically it's they're trying showing to fuck all the moves that yeah all the they're showing all the moves for, so it's a forced checkmate. So it's oh, like I a see. Sequence. They show all the all the moves that can prevent the mate to the last move. I got you. But so yes. although it's yeah. excessive, but they're still trying to do mm -hmm. everything that uh right. yeah exactly very good. Actually, I, I, there, this also is the same theme as another puzzle earlier. This is the, the bishop has to come into play. Oh, this is this is a trade. I think this is just trading. I see they're lined up here, right? This is just like the rooks being lined up. This is like the bishop and queen being lined up. So if I I just go to the corner and he can't do anything, right? Exactly, and it's checkmate. Yeah, it's very good. If he yeah, he can't go forward. Damn. I, I, is there like a pattern uh, chess competition where it's just uh? <laughs> Just, I don't want to start from the beginning of the game. Just throw me into the middle where there's a checkmate and I'll play. Okay, now this one is actually, this is actually really, really hard. I don't think there's, there's almost no chance that you'll, you'll, you'll get Oh, that, I'm interested um, then. Um, <laughs> can you give me a, well, I haven't looked at it yet, but uh, is it worth giving me a hint in terms of the move? Um, is... Okay, I'll say this. It involves a pin. It involves a pin. So uh, the pin, as you said, is about uh, them being forced to trade a big piece Right. Uh, to avoid a checkmate. Uh, right, well, what I'm thinking right now is uh, my C2 guy goes up to C6. Um, right, but uh, but one thing. No, that's not Remember when I when I said pin pins happen? Uh, om they happen almost exclusively with the bishop or the queen, the bishop or the queen. One of those two pieces. All, it's like all the time. Okay. So and then, in this case, it, it involves the bishop. I'm just gonna say it involves the bishop. If this guy goes to C3, then that just gives me a pawn. And it doesn't really set me up for anything, mm -hmm. to be honest. And then if this guy goes to d3, that just gives me his rook. But then it gets traded off by his pawn, so it's nothing. So if I go to d4, and then I can take his horse, but it doesn't set me up for anything again. Uh, okay, what about... No. Mm. Is it... Uh, okay, can you tell me, is my bishop moving first? Uh, I'm pretty sure. I mean, this is a very strange puzzle, but I'm pretty sure it's a queen move first. Oh, it's a queen move first. Okay. So then, yeah. if it's a queen move first, then I would immediately think that my queen just moves straight up for a check. B5 to uh, E8. Okay. Force the my check. King, my king has to go up. Yeah. So I just just play it. I'm, I'm pretty sure that's the move. Okay. And then. If I'm wrong, it's on me, but I'm pretty sure that's the right order. He moves okay. down. I feel like I would just kill his pawn here, no? Do I take it? No. Well, actually, the problem here is if you look at this, your, your opponent's ready to checkmate you in one move with the queen. If the queen goes down to oh yeah, square, g1 or h1, it's checkmate. So I have to There's either check. I have to I have to force him to move without moving his guy down. I have to check him somehow in this move. There's no check here, but there's a move where you're attacking and creating a pin, but you also create space for your king. I could move um, my bishop to c3. Which doesn't do but shit. Then I, would, then I would just go check. Yeah, so I can. I, it has to be my bishop going to e3 or uh, d3 then. Right. That, well, but okay, I don't but know what that does. That move, well, do you see where the king and the rook are? Yeah, they're in the same line. 
I can't move my rook out of the way because then you would capture you, you trade the king. But then why can't you just go down and checkmate me? Because you create a square for your king. So if you, so, just play the move. If you move the bishop up and I check you with my queen, your king scoots to that square where the bishop was on e2. And there's no checkmate. Uh, so you're saying move the bishop to uh, d3, right? Yeah, so I'm saying when he checks you now with the queen, your king scoots up to that square where the bishop was before. So, so okay, I'm saying, okay, uh, just to give you the coordinates. So you move your bishop up one square to d3, right? Mm -hmm. And he's going to move the queen to like g1 or h1. Wait, why can't he just uh, move his queen all the way down? He can, but you're... Oh, but then I'll just move up. Oh, I see, I see. Yeah, your king just saying. moves up. Yeah. Okay, I got yeah. you now. Uh, so now uh, he moves up instead to give me... So he has another check. Right. Um, but now but you then can I, move the king. You can move the king up. But I can I can move the king up, or can I just checkmate him? No, no, I can't. You, I your can't. king's. Like, I'm gonna. So I'm gonna I, capture your king. Oh, uh, if if I'm in check, I have to uh, move my. I have to get out of check first. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. So you move the king up one square. Yeah. Gotcha. And then I and then I think I win that game, right? Because then I just uh, I kill his. You're gonna, rook. you're gonna win the rook. Yeah, you win the rook for the bishop, so it's a three for five trade. Okay, so now this one is a theme we've seen so far in. Um, We've seen, this, we've seen this theme a lot already. Um, okay, so white to move. I don't think that makes... Yeah, I, I think this is it. I think this is it. I think I have it, but I don't know if I do. So I would move my queen to... Uh, is it E6? Uh, so that when mm -hmm. I kill his rook later on, he can't kill my rook because he'll be checked. Right? Exactly, yes. Damn, that, was a, that, that, that required uh, all my brain power, by the way, just to get that one there. That's a very, very good find. Very, very good. Yeah. So it's the queen check, and when the king goes over, you capture the rook, and it's the same check. So he can't. He can't. Um. First. It's the. It's like the. It's not the pin concept because he's not taking the it's piece. The, uh, it's but... the. It's the. Uh, it's the ba back rank checkmate. So yeah, we're moving my. Should I do it? Should I move my queen over yeah, to? Uh, yeah, that's the correct move. Yeah. And then I kill his rook. Yeah, and then it's just checkmate. Wait. Oh wait, he played this one. Wait. Uh, oh fuck. Uh, do you actually let go? I did. I was just yeah, that, doing the moves that I was going I to do. Said capture. I, I didn't actually. I'm, I'm behind you, so I didn't. Um, no, you're good. So I didn't actually see the. the he moved this castle capture. forward, so mm -hmm. then. So you would capture with the queen and then move the queen up once. I would just kill the. I would just kill the horse instead, right? No, no, you would capture the rook with the queen. Oh, kill the rook with the queen, and then and if the he can't, he can't kill my uh, guy, and then the, yeah, his king has to go over, and then my queen moves up again. Exactly, and that's just checkmate. So yeah. it, it would have just played out the same way in the end. Yeah, yeah, that, that would have been checkmate. For the most part, I see like instant improvement, like or like doing like one of these like one two hour collabs. But I do feel like you're actually you have improved from the beginning. For sure, no, right I've uh, I think I've learned a shit ton since the first one. Mm -hmm. I don't know, I don't know how much time you have, but we can't run a game before we uh, end. We can it. play one more game. We can play one more game. Sure. Um, we can play one more game. All right. Let's, um, let's I'll play just I'll send a challenge to. Okay, right. so I'm gonna play. Uh, I'll play something different. I'm gonna play Sicilian. Yeah, I feel like if you know some basic openings, you'll you'll probably get to like seven, eight hundred pretty quickly. Pretty quickly. Okay, sweet. Also, for her, this is uh, this is my little brother's account. I just play on it, so don't mind the rank that you see there. <laughs> right. Wait, okay. wait, no! It's okay. It's okay. Wait, I fucked my whole screen up. What happened here? How do I? Oh my god. Oh my. Wait. It's okay because I can just trade it. Yeah, yeah. It's completely fine. Okay. No, nah, you're not getting that one by me. Come on. <laughs> um, okay, let's see if I can set this up for something even bigger. Um, okay, I'm not going to test my luck here. But I would like to play more aggressive this game, so I'm going to continue that. Um, okay, I'm going to just do this. Now, one thing that's important to note about this is that um, this is uh, we, one of your puzzles was exactly like this earlier. <laughs> okay, just tell me if there's a way to counter what you're doing to me. You, you just lost your queen. You just walked into the same pin. You had this in your puzzle earlier, which is why generally you don't want to bring the queen out too early as right. well. Right, it gets put into a dangerous position. So this right. is lesson learned here. Okay, so yeah, it's like you want to bring out the other, other like the bishops and knights first, and then use the queen. But you don't want it to be the first piece out. Damn, that's a mistake. Yeah. Okay, so I guess best thing I can do is just trade it because it's gonna die. Yeah. It's gonna mm -hmm. die. So I might as well take someone down with me. Yeah. Hmm. Since I want to maintain my map control, and I don't think you'll be able to checkmate me by just me going there for mm -hmm. a second. Just fucking pick something, man. Okay. Uh. 
Uh, no, I'm gonna do the the one that you said because uh, I feel like I don't want to put my king in harm's way. So this one makes yeah, more generally sense. Yeah, generally, generally, still you want to follow the basics of getting your king out of the center of the board. Yep. Okay. Um. So now you're starting to progress, and I think my counter move to that is going to be me pushing your knight to uh, move back. But uh, so you're you're okay with the trade now? Which is fine. Well, remember, I, I have the extra queen, so He's, I actually don't mind yeah, all the trades. Yeah, I'm very so, happy with them. Oh, that's fucked up that I lost the queen so early. <laughs> yeah, that, that's why that's why some basic... That's why just like, if you don't bring the queen out immediately, it's it's better to avoid that if you can. Yeah, that was a massive fuck up. So I, I can't just trade and get by in this game. It's going to have to be yeah. some heroics. Um, can I block that? I can't block that. It's fucked up. I think this is... I, I think this I just settle for the trade. Wait, no. You have a better move. You have a better move, though. Um, I'm starting to kill your pawn. Yeah, so I can move my rook over. And if you do it, I can just get, win that battle. Right? Exactly, yes. Yeah, yeah. I thought about that. For, for some reason, I thought I came out on the bottom. Let's do this. Okay. Okay. I kill him. You kill me. I lose that trade. So I'll just leave it. Mm, I see something cooking up, huh? With the bishop? I think I see something cooking up actually with the queen and the bishop. Something's fishy. Something's fishy. <laughs> <laughs> Something's fishy. Good instincts. Something's fishy. So, uh, and I move my rook out of the way, I think. Yeah. All right, let's fuck it. Let's just do it. I don't know what's going to happen, but it, I think it's. Okay, I didn't expect that to happen. I'm not going to lie. <laughs> I've got to make this trade. I've got to. No matter what, this doesn't. doesn't I know that I'm losing. Uh, big piece here but i think no matter what i have to get your queen out that's what i'm picking up and i didn't see that guy Who, who'd you take out there uh that's the, bishop. the bishop okay well that's very bad i have you have a check no not a mate but it's, it is a checkmate actually uh so this is you're doing that move you're talking about uh the the in between or something like that uh, this is this is the back rank checkmate coming up yeah, so this is where, like, I thought I had your bishop trade coming in, but you've forced me to do other stuff in the meantime. Is, is there a move? I guess that's my question. It's, just, it's, a, for, it's a forced checkmate here. It's forced checkmate, so I, I just, the, the, all I can do is just bring more pieces down for you to kill. Right, yeah, exactly, to kill, and then the king has no squares. It's stuck on this back ring. You can't move up. <laughs> yeah. God damn it. Yeah, it's just Dude, checkmate. Uh, uh, honestly, up. this game was uh, fucked up because I lost my queen so early. Right, right. I mean, I, I think what I would say is this. Like, in general, your instincts are very, very good. Oh. I mean, for someone who's who's completely new to the game, you, you have you have some potential. The way that you spot, spot like, you could tell that something was a little bit off. Like, when, when I played this, like, pawn takes pawn move a couple moves ago, like, the way you could sense that and in general not blundering any pieces was, is very, very good. Like, you have very good awareness of the map. That's awesome. Um, and most hear. people who are new to the game do not have that at all. They they don't. And like you are also learning, sort of you're learning as we were going through it, which is which is quite rare. So you do you do have you do have great potential. You just need to play you just need to play. You just need to play games. Awesome. Yeah. Well, I, I hope to keep practicing and maybe uh I'll come back to play you again or something. And... Yeah, no problem. I mean, obviously, I mean obviously for all the people who are watching on your stream as well, at some point in the future after my upcoming chess tournaments. Hopefully we'll be able to do Valor and everybody can just... That would be they awesome. Can they can laugh at me too, so it, it'll be a fair trade. I'm totally down. Uh, if you ever want to yeah. play Valorant, let me know and we definitely Absolutely. set it up. Yeah, for sure, for sure. All right, thank you, man. Yeah. Have a, Enjoy the rest of your no night. No problem. And, you uh, too. Have a good one. Soon. All right, bye. See ya. Damn. He, he said we would do uh, two hours, but it ended up being closer to three. So that means he liked me. So tell me...